Today in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to fix the Discord overlay. About a couple years ago, I actually made a video on this. And for some reason, I made it eight minutes long and I have a whole bunch of comments that thankfully this method has work to fix their overlay issues, but they've been telling me why is the video eight minutes long, which is true. Why is it eight minutes long? I don't know. So today in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to do it super quick in under eight minutes, most likely even under five minutes. But before that, if you're looking to boost your Discord server for one month or three months, you can head on over to my server boosting site where you can use code CHRIS1 to get up to 69% off boosts. Boost your server to level three for three months for $16.99 or for one month at multiple different price points. Also, if you'd like to join my Discord server, link is down below. All right, the first thing you're gonna wanna do is go to user settings, scroll all the way down to game overlay. And here's where some of your overlay settings are, not all of them. This is very important. This is only where it will display. So for avatar size who have large or small, display names always only while speaking or never, and display users always only while speaking. And you can pick where this overlay will show. Now for some reason, if any of your settings don't look like mine on the screen right now, quickly change them to that because that just might be your issue, especially when enable in-game overlay is off. When this is off, it'll just give you a prompt but make sure that you have it on. So if you're having those issues, make sure that's on first. And I heavily recommend to have a toggle for the overlay lock. Next, what's super important is if we scroll down all the way to registered games. This is a crazy one. So Discord will willingly at random whim disable your overlay. Literally doesn't even tell you. So if you see over here, look, this little icon says toggle overlay, and if it shows this red little X, that means it's not going to pop up. So look at this. The only game it pops up for me, by default, by the way, is Overwatch. All these other games, except for Team Fortress 2, a game I never played, last played seven months ago, has it on. Oh, thank you, Discord. So what you're going to want to do is individually uncheck all of these games because this very well just could be your issue now the game we're going to be using as testing for today is american truck simulator you can see the toggle overlay is in fact on remember red means off and over here you can force toggle it now and then you can also report incorrect game detection a couple things to add when you load up your games make sure they are in full screen and make sure if you do have a second monitor like i do to minimize the discord application because sometimes it doesn't detect it it's really weird with me recently it's now been able to detect it while i have my discord up on my second monitor so your mileage may vary but if nothing pops up let's say it's not a game that's added to discord you can always click not seeing your game click add and you can search for any other software that you currently have on your computer for example i can click spotify click add game. If I load up Spotify, it will work. We're going to go back to settings here though, go back to registered games and we're going to get rid of that. Now, with all that being said, I'm going to go to Steam and load up American Truck Simulator. I am still in fact in a VC. Give the game a second to load and you can see up here, my Discord overlay is working. I'm currently muted. That's why it's not highlighted. Now, if I go back to my Discord and unmute myself, load back up into the game, you can see it's highlighted and it's detecting my voice as well as if anyone else joins. Now, remember, if this doesn't pop up and you did all those settings, keep your game on full screen. And if you have a second monitor, minimize your Discord application. Now I'm clicked into Discord on my second monitor and it's still popping up. Before, it never used to do that. That's why this is an updated version of the video. Now, when I click back into my game, American Truck Simulator, it's still highlighting up. So depending on the application, you might need to minimize Discord on your second monitor, but I don't think that's an issue anymore. And most importantly, if the game is not showing it, you can enable in-game overlay by a toggle, which I heavily recommend having set if it's finicky or acting up. But a lot of the times it is just your registered games either not being properly registered because the Discord clients for some reason not detecting it or they're all turned off. Like, let me scroll down more. See, look, look at all these games. I get it. These are games I haven't played in like over a year. It automatically being set to off, which is just really, really strange. If that doesn't work, 
uninstall and reinstall your discord that's the best advice i can get you hopefully this video was a lot more helpful and you did enjoy it leave a like and subscribe peace